A local holiday tradition made its way back to the River City tonight. Jacksonville's annual boat parade of lights floated down the St. John's River to kick off the holiday season. Good evening to you. Hopefully you had a chance to check it out, but it did not go off without a hitch. The start of the parade was actually delayed by a train. News for Jack's reporter Bree Isom joins us live. Bree, you met up with some locals who came out for the big event. I did, and despite the show being delayed, people still said that this show was amazing. It was the unofficial start to the holiday season here in Jacksonville, and they were very excited. Boats decorated with Christmas lights, even some with lights designed as a Christmas tree, cruised down the St. John's River for the Jacksonville Light Boat Parade on Saturday, a tradition that's been happening in the city for 30 years. The lights are pretty, and then there was a little bit of gingerbread house boat. Participants are judged on overall look and decoration composition. Thousands showed up to this event, but it didn't go without some trouble. The parade was delayed for about a half hour because of a train stopped on the bridge that crosses the St. John's River. It was a little sad, but the lights are still pretty to see. This is a, a, a beautiful thing to do for this river that we had. Enrique Figuero has been going to this light parade for three years now. He and his wife enjoyed the show. It's a, it's a family day. You can come in here and sit down and, and enjoy. The night ended with a fireworks show featuring waterfalls off the main street and Acosta bridges. A pretty cool night here in Jacksonville and coming up at 11. I did talk to some people. They had some complaints about this year's show. That's all coming up. I'm reporting live in Jacksonville, Bree Isom, Channel 4, the local station.